Smiley got a box today. And I'm gonna open and show you what's inside. Okay, it's fine. Dun, dun, dun. Is that a GoPro? This is the GoPro. <laughs> the and GoPro. There's a lot of stuff in here. So, quick recap this is the Hero 10 Black GoPro. COO China. Hmm. Not sure what that means. It comes with a flash memory card, 32 gigs, extreme micro SDHC something, and dual battery charger and um, an extra battery. Let's open this. I am Olena. This is Isaac. And, and we, we are, are the, the Travel Bug, Bug Bite. We met in Prague, Czech Republic. Lived in Shanghai, China. New York and Rhode Island, USA. And now we live in Hawaii. Hawaii. We've traveled from Tibet to Puerto Rico. Harbin to PP. And drove cross country with Smiley in our Tesla Model 3. Subscribe, Subscribe to, to follow, follow our adventures. adventures. How much did we pay for it? 399 I don't remember. I'm pretty sure it was $3.99. It's on sale right now. This is the um, SD card that it comes with. I do like uh, this company, SanDisk Extreme, but I have even better ones and bigger ones. This is only 32 gigs. That's enough for five seconds of smiley licking his face or <laughs> something cute like that. Good to get you started just so you can at least use it out of the box. I think that's the idea. That is true. Here's the charger. That's not as exciting. So let's open this first. All right. So we actually film mostly on my iPhone, um, sometimes on Isaac's iPhone, and we also use the Yee Action Cam. The Yee Action Cam is a, I don't want to say knockoff of GoPro, but it is. Competitor. It's a competitor, but they literally copied all the good features, and for a while it was even better. But they don't seem to be making them anymore. It's the Yee 4K Plus Action Cam, and I've had it for six years now? Four. Four. And before that, I uh, have um, GoPro 3, I think. So this is my first real GoPro. And I destroyed the box because I'm like that. I'll throw it away anyway. But this can uh, do two. This has a 23 MP camera, uh, can film 5.3K at 60 FPS, plus 4K at 100. Oh, yeah, and 120 FPS. So cool. um, choose the settings. Uh, FPS is, you know, it's great if you want to capture really like slow motion and it's all. Awesome, and it's voice controlled. It's waterproof up to 10 meters without a case, which I like. The Yi is needs a waterproof case. It, it can slow mo up to eight times, I think directly on the camera. It has data overlays, I'm not sure what that means. It offers 1080p live streaming directly from the camera, which is cool if you want to preview what you just did. It does time warp <sighs> and offers, you know, great photos. Super photo, as it says, plus HDR, plus raw photos. Raw photos are great if you want to edit them after. And you can set it up to upload automatically to the cloud. So hopefully I can connect it to my iCloud, where I have, I think, four terabytes. A lot of data there. And it has webcam mode as well. And it is mod ready, so you can add flash or anything else you want to do. I want to see it. Box. I Open know. It. Cool case. I like that it comes with a case. Oh, it's pretty. And smells like a new camera. Oh, no, 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 don't do that. Okay. Here is ah, the GoPro. Let's rip this little paper. Oh, my favorite thing. Oh, stickers. So many stickers. So it's maintaining its like classic look. It is. My biggest problem with GoPros is that um, there's no like, you have to get a case to protect the screen. Otherwise if you scratch it, there's always a scratch. I have the GoPro 360 and scratch on both sides. Huh. And that's pretty terrible because then your 360 view is completely messed up. This is the protector I bought for the GoPro and it has two sticker screen protectors for each screen. And it's got a, two caps to put over the main camera. It's only $10. It is so easy to put on and it protects it perfectly. So I really recommend this product. And in, this is interesting. This is new. Instead of, oh, 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 
So when I say this is new, I mean this is different from the three that I have. It can be flat and you can use it like that, I guess. And this fits, you know, all the GoPro mounts that you've seen. Yeah, the, these ones. Cool. Stuck and is it charged at all? Probably no. slightly to hold it in. Ah, it's stuck. Help. There. Uh, you don't there's no battery in, in there's it. No battery. <laughs> So, whoa, this is hard to open because it's, you know, waterproof. Am I breaking it? Oh, you pull it, but you don't open it. You pull it and this opens. And then you put the battery in. Never, <laughs> I used to want to tear these off. Don't tear them off. That's how you pull the battery out. And I saw a light. <gasps> and the GoPro fisheye that I miss so much. Hi. <laughs> Whoa, I can see you. Whoa, I can see myself. Select that is English. so cool. Do you Don't see mess yourself? That up. We, we, had, we had our Yi in Chinese for a while. Mm. Touch screen? Uh, legal stuff. <laughs> Agree. GPS on. Stalk me. Uh, install GoPro quick on my phone. Yeah. I'm gonna do that. Alrighty. But first, let me show you what else it comes with. It comes with um, this and this. This you can stick onto anything. We're probably gonna stick it in the Tesla. So we like to use a GoPro as a dash cam sometimes. And you put this in so you can slip the GoPro in and out. Obviously using this thing. And it comes with a manual. But you know, we watch YouTube videos instead. And of course this, let me quickly show you this. This came with it for free, I think, right, Isaac? I think. Maybe it was part of the deal. I think it's a early Black Friday deal. Like I said, I don't open boxes so well because I throw them away anyway. You could have bought, I think, uh, a bigger SD card and like a, I don't know. Oh, and a little um, selfie stick Yeah. for $50 more, but I'm going to buy my own on Amazon for a lot less. So this is the selfie stick that I bought for the GoPro. It's really simple. It's only $15 because I plan on taking it underwater and it's probably going to end up rusting. Um, it, I what I like about this is that it's really easy to hold. It has a really great grip. It's really tiny, but at the same time, it does um, work as a tripod as well. And it does uh, come out a little. It's slightly extendable. It's not the longest extension. Not great, actually great for proper like selfie videos but it's better than nothing. And I like that it's an all-in-one solution. Um, of course, if you wanna do other things, it's better to have a selection of different selfie sticks and tripods, but if you aren't sure what you're gonna be doing for the day, this is a great thing to have because it can do a little bit of everything. So this is the charger and it's got um, a nice uh, rubbery base so that it won't slip. A grip. A grip. And it's... USB-C. USB-C, which we like. And that is all, and I have the extra battery, and I'm really excited to get started, but for that, I need my phone back, so. Bye. If you liked our video, don't forget to click the like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. Check out our videos from all around the world, and let us know what you'd like to see next. Thanks for watching!